Tonight, a 13-year-old is under arrest in Taunton, accused of taking his mother's rifle and shooting a 12-year-old boy. And police say this may have started with a case of cyberbullying. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Lisa Hughes. And I'm David Wade. Police say the bullying may have started online, and the boy immediately went for a gun instead of talking to an adult. Mike LaCrosse is live for us in Taunton tonight with more on the story. Mike? David, we spoke with the suspect's mother. We are not identifying her or her son because he is a minor. She tells me that her son has been tormented by kids in the neighborhood and threatened for years and that he called her moments after the shooting happened this afternoon. Like he's a good kid. It just he they've been doing this for two years. So I mean he just had enough. The mother of a 13-year-old boy who police say shot a 12-year-old boy this afternoon is speaking out tonight, defending her son, saying he has been tormented for years. My son had called me and told me that they came in the yard and they were trying to stab him, and he was scared, so he went to. Like, as the kids were, like, leaving the yard, like, running away from the yard, he went to, like, go shoot in the air, and it shot him in the arm. The then shot went into his elbow, came out the interior portion of his elbow, and then into his abdomen, or in his uh, rib cage. The 12-year-old is recovering from that gunshot wound tonight at a Rhode Island hospital. Taunton police say the shooting happened in the woods around noon today in the area of 100 High Stone Street, and that it follows an ongoing feud between the two boys through social media. And I believe that part of this has to do with some texting and some what maybe the victim would describe as uh, bullying. Or maybe even the, uh, the defendant felt that he was bullied and he was defending himself. Police say the suspect got the 22 rifle from his mother's locked gun cabinet and that it's unclear if he had the key or knew the combination. The victim is in stable condition tonight, and his family was not prepared to comment when we went by their home. They told us to check back in with them again tomorrow. Meanwhile, the suspect is in the custody of the Department of Youth Services and is charged with assault and battery with a dangerous weapon. No word yet when he'll be arraigned. We're live in Taunton tonight. I'm Mike LaCrosse, WBZ News.